Hey, uh, my name's Marcus Potter uh, and I'm uh, the chief engineer for this ironclad unmanned ground vehicle here. So this is a, an autonomous vehicle that's uh, designed to take the dull, dirty and dangerous jobs away from the soldier. Uh, it's, as I say, it's fully autonomous. It uh, weighs about 400 kilograms and its key aspects are it's got high mobility. It can go up to 30 kilometers per hour and it's got a range of up to 50 kilometers. Uh, it also is armour protected to protect against mine blast and also small arms fire. And could you tell me what type of customers um, this particular vehicle has been designed for? Okay, so this is a, a Kazivac uh, mission role that's currently fitted. So it's designed for the army to extract a, a casualty out of the battlefield and take them back to a safe zone where they can uh, perform further medical attention on the, uh, on the soldier. I understand it's quite modular in nature, so can this um, vehicle carry out other roles as well? Absolutely, so the, uh, the, the Kazivac system on top will remove by sliding rails and you can fit any system such as a remote weapon station, such as um, uh, other mission fits with sensor suites etc. Um, and in addition the, uh, the double track system that you see here can be separated to uh, two single track systems that will drive independently of them each other. And in terms of terrain, what kind of terrain can this vehicle handle? Well, this, this vehicle, having the four tracks as it is, is uh, will handle all terrains. So it'll handle uh, quite steep slopes up to 45 degrees. It will go cross country, it will go in an urban environment, and it will also travel across desert environments as well. And could you tell me how the vehicle is powered? Uh, this is powered by four separate motors on each, uh, each independent track system, um, which drive it, as I say, up to about uh, 30 kilometres per hour. And is this the only configuration of the vehicle? Well, it can be offered in either the double track configuration, as you see here, or a single track configuration, which is more aimed towards a, an urban environment and will fit through doorways um, in, in most urban situations. And has any testing been carried out on the vehicle at all? Yes, it has been tested back in Telford, uh, where uh, BA Systems is based, um, and, uh, and the parameters have been checked out and its, uh, its performance has been uh, validated there. And could you tell me anything about the auton autonomous um, capabilities of the system? So, BA Systems have been developing autonomy for over 10 years now. Uh, we have an MOATV vehicle that was developed in 2009, and we've uh, developed a Wildcat vehicle since then. Um, and uh, uh, this vehicle is uh, going to have the autonomy sensor kit fitted to it uh, which will allow waypoint navigation or a follow me uh, role to be performed. And so is this vehicle available now for customers? Uh, this vehicle needs uh, a little bit of productionization. This is a prototype vehicle um, but within 12 months uh, we will be able to produce a, a production vehicle.